What's up guys? How you guys doing? Hope your day's been great. I know New Year's is right around the corner. Um, so, t number one is that I just want to let you know that behind the scenes, there's a lot going on. You might be thinking this guy's just taking a break or whatever. No, behind the scenes, there's a lot going on. I just need to tell you one thing real straight up real quick is that I had my editor and everything. I had all the video ready to go and it would have been by now you be, you would have been watching the final product. I'm telling you. But then my thing got all ex it just whammed out on me. Exactly. The new word on street is whammed out. So my laptop just whammed out. Not in my lab, my software. So I'm just saying bye bye to my new software and I got something new. I want to learn it, I'm going to master it, I'm going to give it to you guys greatly, and you guys are going to see something. My quality has been here, so I thought, you know what, um, new, year, new year, new resolution, new this, new that, so how about new video quality, as in new effects, new things, just more stuff for you guys so I can deliver more things to you. But, I want to just quickly, briefly, this is like a quick, quick video, but I just want to do a quick video on how to create or craft the best New Year's resolution. Okay. Number one, and this is right on the spot right now, so it's not like I planned it or anything. Number one is how to create. So, what was the question again? Okay, so how to create the best New Year's resolution. It's real simple, it's not that hard. Let's get right down to it. So, number one is first, you have to think about what you really want to get accomplished in life. So for example, if you have goals towards school, you're going to aim for that. And that's real great New Year's resolution. If you have goals for, for example, getting better at a sport, you're going to work your butt off the whole season. And by the end of the time, you're probably going to win a game. Or you're probably going to beat your time. Okay, if you're like in swimming or track or something like that. Whatever it is, you're going to try to, you know, set that goal. You're going to have like three to four goals. Just a pointers on the goals would be make them realistic something that you can achieve something even if it takes a year something you can you know at the end get if you have bigger goals for example you want to buy a house or you want to I don't know you want to um, do something like financial you're in the business sector right now you want to get somewhere you want to make a deal or whatever you might be thinking why is he talking like that for his age I'm just saying anything can happen at any time at any age you don't have to be this much to accomplish this you just have to have you know if there's a will there's a way it's simple as that so just keep a will in mind and then the way will open that's all okay and I know last year right around this time I had a video last year you can check that out as well um, I'll try to keep a link down below if I can it's okay but you guys should check that out. <clears throat> so make the goal realistic, something you can achieve. So set out your goals. Number two is don't create a plan. Everyone's going to tell you create a plan, create a plan, create a plan. Don't create a plan. If you want to even create a plan, keep a mental plan right here. You know why? Because if you keep a mental plan, just seeing it on paper can give you a boost. I'm not saying it's not going to. But if you keep a mental plan, that's something that you don't even need to use paper so you're, so you're saving trees so one tree's down no one tree stays up that means you're not wasting paper but even besides that I'm talking about keeping it here because if you have it here you can be on the train catching the ride home and you could be thinking about your plan right here so you, that's why you don't need it here so once you have it in here because even the paper is trying to give you the plan in here you know what I'm saying the paper is there to accommodate what you need to put in your brain really so once you have it in your brain, that's all. You don't even need that paper anymore. So you're the plan. So if you make yourself the plan, you make yourself strive towards that plan, then you can do it, my friend. So that's all I'm saying. Put it here and make it achievable. And you can do it. And number three, just make it fun. You know, Don't make it too hard. Don't, don't make it very stressful. And really, really try to assess the year before. Now I'm not saying go over the whole day 365 days you had from last year go over day one day two then go over day 20 then go over day 100 then go over day 244 then go 361 two, three, and four, and 365 the day like today like january and i mean december 31st of 
2015. Don't do that. I'm not saying that. Just assess in your mind what you did last year, where you went, what you did, how you did it, how many times you did that act, what you did, yada, 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 and assess it from there. And I'm telling you, you're probably going to find something from there. And that's how you make the easiest, most best, constructed, well thought out New Year's resolution plan for you and me and anyone that's watching. And that's pretty much it. Again, I'm telling you, something's coming. Something is coming. But I just gotta give you something right now. Bada bing, bada bing, bada bong. Have a good holiday. Have a, I hope you had a great Christmas. Hope you had a yada, yada, yada. Hope you had everything that you wanted. Just strive hard. Work your butt off on everything you do, you know. And that's pretty much it. So if you did like this, you give it a big thumbs up. If you did this, if you did that, whatever. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. And I want you to remember that next year's right around the corner. Like literally, like in, I don't know, seven to eight hours. I'm not even sure, or nine. It's really there. Have fun at the ball drop if you're going. Oh my God, I could rant about the ball drop, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna keep it short and nice. Still six minutes of video worth time. So yeah, have a nice day.